Welcome to Waterfall Cottage. I'm Cherie, and that's Tommy. And today we might be gardening, remodeling, cooking, canning, or tending to our chickens. Stick around and see what we are up to today. Hey y'all. So we are out here today to begin working on the front porch of our $50,000 lake shack. Um, the stray cats are eating some leftover chicken, so ignore them. Um, but we have need, we are originally when we bought this house, it had a little front porch, but if, if you see this screen door right here, you could, you could not only open it about halfway before it hit the ceiling. And <clears throat> so that was one of the very first things that I tore down was the, um, covered porch. So it's been an open porch or stoop ever since then. And so if it's raining, you have rain pouring down on your head when you're trying to get groceries in or just trying to unlock the door to get in the house. And so that's number one reason we want to uh, put the porch back. Number two was are these steps that are here are treacherous. There's a lip about that big so someone eventually is going to hit the lip of the step here and go flying and bust their head on this concrete and the third thing is it will give some more shade to the living room which is the first room you walk into you can see the carport over here that's our, it's blocking a lot of the sun but this will block more of the sun off that front door right there so anyway um Tommy has started a little prep work, which you can't see, it's way up there, but we're going to hopefully get it all done today. Um, well, we don't have the, the metal for the roof, I don't think. Cause, well, we haven't really decided if we're going to do brown like the house uh, or just the gray metal like on the uh, carport. If we decide to go ahead and go with the gray like over here, then we we have some of that. But we're gonna take a look at it when we're done with the framing to decide what, which one we're going to use. So I am really looking forward to getting this done. Another thing is, is when we build the new stairs, it'll have railings so that some people that come and go from our house have a hard time getting in and out. So that's gonna make it a lot nicer and I'll have somewhere to hang some more plants, like maybe ferns like this right here. I'm gonna go let Tommy know that I am ready to get started. Heidi ho neighbors, welcome back. We're starting on our porch, cover, roof, whatever you wanna call it, our stoop. Um, so stick around while we do some work. So you're just making a big rectangle on the ground first? Which to me is on the ground, but okay. How hot is it out here, baby? Feels like about 110. That's about right. <laughs> Got the bottom frame done. Don't show them twisted post holes. <laughs> well, nothing we can do. You won't be able to see them after it's all done. No. So, on to the next part. All right, we're back at it again today. And today, instead of using the chop saw to cut the four by fours, he's going to use his uh, chainsaw.
What size screws are you using, honey? Are they like six inches? Six inch. That way it goes through the four by four and gets me about three inches in there. Cool. Oops. Got it in? So are you saying it's close enough? So we have a heat index today of 113. We are dying out here. well he's got four of the six posts up and now we're going to do some of the top framing Can you pull up? <laughs> exhausted as I am. And if I wasn't exhausted, I'd probably do it once. So all the posts are up now, right? Yes. Yay. So we did not get finished. Um, it got dark and then the next day it rained. And You know, Tommy works a full-time job. I work as well. So we didn't get finished. So I'm going to go ahead and end the video here. Uh, otherwise, it'll be two or three weeks before I get another video out. Uh, we did get all the poles set, and Tommy wants me to go ahead and use this same stain that we used on the shutters on the framing part, um, so that even though it's you can't see it and it's under the deck boards, that it'll have a little bit more protection. And I need to let those dry out from the rain before I can stain them. So I'm going to go ahead and get that done. And Tommy had to get the pressure washer fixed so he could uh, pressure wash the rec reclaimed lumber that we're using. So there's a lot of behind the scenes things that um, you guys don't really see that explain delays in getting projects finished. So no, the porch isn't finished, but it will hopefully get finished this week. Um, especially since we're getting more rain now as fall gets closer because... I would like to be able to bring in my groceries without getting soaking wet from the rain coming off the roof. So I'm going to close this video now and stay tuned for part two. Thank you guys for watching and we will see you on the next video. He has temporarily just put a, a piece of plywood here so we have something to walk on. There's that side. And there is, there's the posts on that side, so.